What is this? What is this? Wow, very dubious. <laughs> very dubious. Is it bubble tea again? You're trying to be fancy or... At the top of three, right? You must take it out quick and fast, okay? Are you ready? Yes. Three. One. Two, three! Yeah! <laughs> ah! Oh my god! <laughs> it's all in Japanese! There's like this candy. This one! This one inside got extra jelly. This thing, right? I can finish the whole bag in like one sitting. I love this. This is so good. Hi, guys! Hey. Hi! Hi! I recently I went to Japan. Then I tried like quite a bit there. I don't try a lot of Japanese candy. So I don't know what is it and the packaging looks very nice but I'm not sure how it tastes. There's this inside right, they have added texture, it's like mm. little little tubes of jelly. There's this round jelly thing, mm. they have flavours like grape, oh. melon, apple, oh, orange. Melon, melon. I like the one because like not too sweet. Creamier. Yeah, it's very addictive. And I think the taste is like a lot stronger and they do like matcha and milk flavours very well. Yeah, I feel like thanks. their flavour right, especially fruity flavour, they really nail it. So today, we'll be trying some popular candy from Japan that mm -hmm. you can actually find in Singapore now. Oh. Wow. Let's go, let's go. Yes, yes! Oh my god! Woo! Okay, this is one of the very few Japanese candies that I eat. They have two other flavours. It's coffee and strawberry. Oh! It's not chewy. Oh! Nice, yeah. It is very milky and creamy. It definitely tastes a lot like milk. The surface is very smooth. Actually, it tastes a bit more premium. Sometimes milk has this like very smelly. Especially mm. like milk candy because it's very concentrated, right? Yeah! But this one, no. This one is just... Mm. It's milk. But it's still sweet. Love matcha. <laughs> Love matcha. What the hell? Again, it's like very creamy. The matcha taste also, it tastes quite premium. Because you know there's different types of matcha. This one tastes like the more expensive one. I prefer the matcha because there's like more layers to it when it comes to the flavour composition. Mm. So the matcha one, right, is not as sweet as the original one. So I if you don't like like sweet things, then go for the matcha one. Mm. Oh my god, Ooh. I love this. It is so cute eh. It's got a little ball. I love it because Japanese right, they put a lot of thought into like the packaging. <laughs> it definitely appeals more to the younger crowd lah. Oh, it smells Whoa. super good. It smells like grape yogurt. You see the surprise? Yeah, I like how it's a little bit sour. The texture is very interesting because outside is chewy. Then once you hit the middle, it's like a bit like juicy. This one cause like got the extra jelly right, then it's like chewier. Okay, cola time. This smells like fizzy cola. Oh! Oh! No, the business is cold! Yeah! Wow! Oh, really heavy! Eh. Yeah. Once you chew enough until you get to the middle of it, it's surprisingly very refreshing, you know? Wow, very interesting! I've never tried this flavor before. Pucho you cool! I really like the different textures inside the soul. Mm. Yes! I love this! These packaging look a lot more premium. It's like it's got a curved bottom, right? But because the down here is white, so you can stand. Can stand. I'm very excited because like apparently there's two different textures like there's the gummy part and then the outside also has that collagen. Oh the packaging is resealable. Oh my god it's so soft. It smells like wine eh. Look at these eh. They actually look like juiciest grapes eh. Okay I get what you mean by they have the regions. Yeah. Look how yeah. they seal it up. Wow, hey, the skin, Whoa. there's really skin. But the texture is still very interesting because like, your teeth still need to break that like, outer layer. So it's really like a grape. It's not like chewy or anything. It's fleshy. Yeah. It's really like a grape wall. Like just now I thought the Pucho grape candy, right? That grape was legit. But I think this is the legit one eh. It's really like concentrated grape juice flavour. But then with a more gummy mouthfeel. Oh, the smell smells like, you know Kyo, the white grape flavour. Yeah. Oh my god, this is nicer eh. This one is a lot lighter, mm. a lot like fruitier in some sense. And sweeter also lot, I think. The sweetness kind of lingers on at the yeah. back. Oh my god, the smell is just... Wow, bang oi! You all like this candy, right? Mm. Mm. So we actually got more flavours for you to try. And it also tastes better when it's chilled. So we actually chilled all the other flavours.
Alright, let's try the peach. It smells like pink dolphin. Well, I think you put in the fridge nicer, yeah. It's firmer, yeah. When you bite into it, it really like boom, burst. Inside got peach. It's like a little square of fruit inside. Oh, I like this more, eh. This one actually tastes like, like the actual like the fruit, fruit. Yeah. So it's not like they played around the flavors or anything, yeah. Eh, look, if you look at it, right? Oh my god! Got something inside, la. Eh, I see, I see, I see, okay. Mmm! Oh, the mango is so nice! The taste is very strong. It's a very concentrated yeah, it's mango. Very, flavor. very concentrated. If you love mango in general, I think you would really like this. Oh my god, you can see the strawberry seeds inside. Wow, it's a strawberry. Actually, it's a bit sour. Oh, I can taste the seeds. Yeah. I actually bit into the seeds. The seeds is quite amazing. It really tastes like you're eating a strawberry. But yeah. in gummy form. So after they have a secret flavor, they won't tell you what it is. So what do y'all think the next flavor is gonna be? Durian. Durian! Melon, melon. These look like pearls. Each ball mm. has 500 layers. And it takes huh? 36 hours to make one ball. Huh? Huh? How? What? So, when you eat it right, it will change its flavor like after a while. It's quite cooling eh? mm. Right? It's smooth, Maybe. it's hard. Like, like it's a bit sweet. Oh, it became sour. Is oh, change it, change it. Mine change it. Now it's a bit sour. Oh, okay. Oh, it's back to sweet. Yeah, it's back to sweet. Shit, the sour is so nice. Oh, mine change it again. Okay. It's very fast eh, actually. Yeah, it's 500 years. And then you have no idea what flavor yeah. is gonna come up. This one is like, you won't get sin because every like 10 seconds, you get a new flavor. Mm. The good thing is that it's easy to carry around now. I'm so small and compact. Ororo! It's like it's chewy but then also got the snack. The texture is so unique that I don't think you can find any in this market. Yeah. So like it's really quite legit. Like, it's really like eating grapes mm. without seeds. I really like Kororo because I think it's like one of the most premium gummy candies that I've ever had. My favourite was the first one, the milk candy. The matcha is really quite legit. Like now I really want to go and try the other flavours. Yeah. So. My opinion hasn't really changed because I always think that Japanese candies are very premium. I was kind of like proved right lah. I yeah. just never had the chance to try all of these products before. I already had like a very good impression of Japanese candy. After trying these right, I definitely would recommend different ones to different people. So if you would like to try the candies that are featured in this video, we are actually giving away a handful of Yuha products to 10 lucky winners. That's right, all you need to do is to like this video, mm. subscribe to ebook, and comment down below on what you think the next Kororo gummy flavor will be. And why you want to win this sample. Alright, thanks for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, remember to like, share, and subscribe. And watch our other videos there. Bye! Bye. Sugar Rush! <laughs> oh.